Hello, dear class. Good evening. Hello. Hello, everyone. Hi, it's a pleasure to have you here. Welcome, everybody. All of you are connecting. So I will give you a couple of seconds for you to finish connecting. All right, we are getting ready. Yeah, I have been getting ready for you since the day that I told that I was told that I was going to be with you. And I said, yeah, I want to meet my group. I said, it's such a happiness to have you here. It is really exciting when you put a face on a name. That's pretty awesome. Cuando me dan la lista de nombrecitos, digo yo, okay, quiero ponerle carita a todos los nombres. <laughs> that is, and that's what I am doing right now. All right, sounds great. Great. So remember to keep your cameras on because I need to know you and I need to see your beautiful faces. Okay. Thank you very much. And... Apart from a requirement for the class, it is nice because it keeps us connected when we can see each other. Thank you for all the cameras that I am getting now. Thank you very much. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening, Jancy. How are you? Fine. <laughs> fine, teacher. <laughs> that is like more than Thank fine. You. Being fine. <laughs> <laughs> yes. That's nice. Thank you, Jancy. Well, I am very happy to have you here. I know this time it's difficult, but it's admirable. Okay. Es la hora más admirable y son los que más se ganan mis aplausos. Okay. Si estamos aquí hasta ahora, es porque de veras queremos superarnos. Queremos salir adelante y queremos seguir aprendiendo. And that is really admirable. So I really enjoy these times of class because I can have the opportunity to be with you, to share, to learn, right? And then you can go to sleep, right? With a lot of learning in your brain. That will be part of our everyday in class. Well, let's start our day by giving some generalities. I am going to give you a little bit on introduction of the topics on the things that we are going to do. I am going to present myself. I'm going to introduce myself to the team and we are going to, oh, my camera, it's crazy. Hey, you see, the, the action began. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with Zoom. It has been happening like for, for a couple of days, but let me share my screen with everybody. And here we go. Let me know if you can see my screen. And here it is. Okay, today is our first day. It's our introduction to the class. And for sure, uh, if I have been with you before, let me know, right? If I have been your teacher before. So it's a pleasure to see you again. And if it is our first time together, it's a pleasure to meet you, okay? So tell me, did you practice English on vacation? Yes or no? So, so teacher. So, so, uh -huh. did you practice English? Yes or no? Raise your hand if you did it. Levanten la manita si practicaron English. Or only that we wish you a Merry Christmas. That was the only thing that you practiced. And a Happy New Year. And Happy New Year. <laughs> Hello, we wish you Merry Christmas. That was the only practice that you did. Okay. <laughs> so, none of you practice English. Ninguno practicó inglés en toda la vacación. No les creo. Yes, teacher. Okay, Jancy, yes. She practiced. Who else? Yes. Okay. Only with Duolingo. Meet you. Oh, only with Duolingo. Okay, it's the first time meeting me. Thank you very much. Well, but for me, it's a big pleasure to be your teacher and for sure to serve you on this module. 
We are okay. going to be together for 16 days, but I am going to do my best to help you improve your English, right? To help you understand and to help you uh, get more knowledge of the language. Okay. Here, I am going to share a little bit about me. Who is the person serve you here at the front? This is me. This is your teacher. Here you have it. My name is Evelyn Natalie Monterosa. I am an English teacher. I have been a teacher for 19 years of my life. Okay, and you might say like, teacher, 19 años. Yes, I have been a teacher for 19 years. I started very, very, very young when I was 18 years old. That was my first time teaching. And I haven't stopped, right? That this moment hasta aquí. No nos hemos detenido. And I have been teaching for all this time. I am a licenciada in idioma inglés. And, but I have different things that I have done with my life. I have been practicing English in many different fields. I have my licenciatura in idioma inglés. I have different diplomados in metodologías, e-learning, leadership, uh, didactic. I have uh, diplomados in pedagogía, in planificación, diseño curricular, etc. Como ustedes, soy una experta en el inglés en proceso. Right, we are working and learning every day. I am an INSAFOR certified teacher for all the different levels, and I have worked in many different things. I started my teaching career at Universidad Católica de Occidente. I was a teacher there in the free courses of English and also as part of the major. I work at Instituto Americano de Idiomas in Santa Ana as well. A, eh, a, colaboramos para la creación del instituto, hicimos su diseño curricular y todo desde cero. También fui traductora e intérprete en la Fundación eh, de Niños Apadrinados en Santa Ana. Trabajé 10 años en el programa empresarial Supérate como docente de inglés. Trabajo desde hace casi dos años con Regal International Inglés Corporativo. I have been working here for a lot of time. And eh, right now, Soy directora también de English Learning Center San Salvador. Es una academia de idiomas. También está aquí en el área de San Salvador. Ahí trabajo como directora en el día y pues trabajo como maestra de ustedes por la noche. Y soy alumna, exalumna del programa Fulbright de la Embajada de Estados Unidos. Tuve la oportunidad de ir a aprender a Estados Unidos durante alrededor de siete semanas. Estuvimos allá aprendiendo en la Universidad de Arkansas pues para traer mejores estrategias para servirles a ustedes de la mejor manera. Así que eh, esa soy yo, ese es el ser que les está sirviendo en este día y pues estoy muy feliz de estar como parte de este nuevo grupo. And what is learning if you don't share it? Yo siempre les digo, ¿de qué sirve aprender si no compartimos? And that's my purpose, right? If I know something, I am going to share it with you for you to improve. And that will be my main goal with you. So, but if I am going to do my best, I need you to do your best. We are going to have different homework and different evaluations as part of the platform. Remember that you need to have at least 80% of the, um, the progress in the platform for you to go to the next module, okay? Ya la mayoría de ustedes, si no es que todos, creo que todos ya han estado aquí por eh, cursos anteriores o es su primera vez aquí. Who is, this is the my first, first time? The first time. I'm this is your. Here. Okay, you are, you are this, new here. This is my first yeah. time. Oh, this is your first time as well. In English yeah. Corporativo. My God, ever, yes. Is this your first time as well? Yes, teacher, my first time. Okay, well, important then. Eh, todos tienen acceso a la plataforma educativa. Entonces, para pasar al siguiente módulo, tenemos que cubrir al menos el 80% de todo el avance de la plataforma. Okay, so we need to work a lot on that. I am going to show you the platform in a moment, right? All the homework are in the platform. You are going to find activities in the platform that you are going to be covering during the class. And for sure, we are going to be working in the platform in during every single day, okay? 
la plataforma no está estrechamente ligada a que solo se trabaje un día. Okay? You can work in the platform starting today. Hoy mismo pueden empezar a avanzar en la plataforma para que ustedes eh, puedan tener ese 80, 100% listo al final del curso. Okay? So it is really important that you advance on the platform as much as possible. The idea of this is that by January 27, you have the midterm uh, exams, uh, the midterm activities completed. And for uh, February 7, all the platforms should be done. Okay? Esas son las dos fechas que yo les he puesto de límite. Para el 27 de enero, usted puede tener la mitad de la plataforma completa. Y para el 7 de febrero, todos los ejercicios de la plataforma ya completados. And you might say, Teacher, but how am I going to finish the platform eh, so fast? We are here to help each other. Okay? We are going to be collaborating. We are going to be helping each other for you to finish everything on the platform. If you say, teacher, I have problems with one exercise, I am here to help you. Or any of your friends can help you. Okay? So don't doubt about asking for help. Okay? Nunca duden eh, en el hecho de pedir ayuda. Si se traen en un ejercicio, rapidito al grupo de chat, teacher, tengo problemas con el ejercicio tal y tal de la sección tal. Okay? And I am going to help you as fast as possible. Okay, so the WhatsApp group, it is meant to be, I mean, we need to work together on the WhatsApp group, right? And if you have a question, I can help you or any of your friends can do it, okay? Any of your friends can help you with the questions. It is really necessary that you are always using the group for educational purposes. Here we have that uh, for sure the requirements you need to have your complete name at the moment of connecting to the platform right i think everybody has it todos ustedes tienen su nombre completo ahí en la plataforma right and uh, you need to have it ready okay i don't know what's going on with my camera or my video i am mm -hmm. having a lot of issues with it si ven que se pone como bien activo así, no crean que estoy en la disco. ¿eh? No sé qué le está pasando. <laughs> you need to have your complete name at the moment of connecting, right? In case that you are just a listener. Creo que aquí no tengo ningún oyente, pero en el caso de que algún día alguien se conecte como oyente, le tiene que poner la palabra oyente después de su nombre. Aquí no tengo ninguno de esos casos. Keep the camera on all the time during the session. I always do it. But right now, I, am, I don't know what's going on with my video. But the idea to have the camera is that you can actually see each other at the moment of working, okay? La cámara lo que hace es que nos conecta a pesar de estar lejos, right? Because you can see the person. You can see the person talking to you. You can see the person collaborating with you. You can see the person teaching you, right? So that's why the camera is very important. So you can actually see that you are there in the class. A mí me sirve para saber que usted está ahí presente, que está poniendo atención, que está enfocado en lo que estamos haciendo. So keep the camera on all the time during the whole class because that is going to be very, very helpful for us and to keep you here and to keep you practicing. Okay, thank you for all the ones who have it on and who have it connected. Attendance is very crucial because you need to have 80% of attendance during the whole period of class, the 16 days complete. Why? Because that is going to give you the pass for the next module, okay? Asistencia completa, 100%, the 60 minutes of the class. That is going to give you the perfect attendance because you need 80% of attendance to go to the next module. Right? I am going to call the attendance as well. Les voy a pasar lista a la mitad de la clase y tienen que contestar here teacher or present teacher. Okay? So when I call your name, you have to say here teacher or present teacher or presente if you want to use it like that. But it, you are intermediate. You don't have to use that anymore. And in Zoom, it is 
you have the different buttons, right? You have the one to raise your hand to participate. You have the mute button to turn off your microphone. The camera that has to be on. You have the chat as well that you can use to send questions. If you need help as well, you can use the chat. The breakout rooms that we are going to be using to work in mini groups. And for sure, if you need help, you can raise your hand. You can let me know. You can send a message in the chat. You can send a message on WhatsApp. And I am going to be more than glad to attend your question, OK? I know everybody knows how to raise the hand, right? Todos saben cómo levantar la manita en, what, in, in Zoom, right? Show me. Can you raise your hand, please? Todos levanten su manita. Uh -huh. Good, 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 good. Raise your hand. Very good job. Thank you very much. I can see that all of you can do it. That's very nice. Cuando pida un voluntario, that's the way you are going to do it. I want to see all those hands exactly like the ones you are raising right now. Thank you very much. You can lower your hand. Así, igualito vamos a levantar cuando pido un voluntario. If I say volunteers, a lot of hands up at the same time. That would be nice. Thank you very much. Now I can see that you can do it. Let me see. What else? And respect. Right, respect your your classmates, respect your friends when they participate because all of us are learning. Okay. De repente nos vamos a reír con algo que pasa en clase. Yes. Nos vamos a reír de algún chiste, alguna cosa que digamos. Yes. But we are not going to make fun of the other classmate. No nos vamos a reír de los demás ni de nuestros compañeros. So keep it in mind. The calendar of activities. What are we going to be doing? during these days. I have here, and I am going to send this one on WhatsApp in a moment, right? Ya les, ya se lo voy a enviar por WhatsApp. In the first week, we have four different weeks that we are going to be together. And in week number one, that it's going to be from the 18th to the 24th, we are going to work on the platform, sections one and two, okay? Week number two, section three, and the midterm. Week number three, sections four and five. And week number four, you are going to work on your final exams. Okay? Así se los he dividido para que ustedes puedan ir trabajando la plataforma de una manera ordenada y que pues puedan avanzar. No estamos ligados a que esas secciones son las únicas que vamos a trabajar. Si usted la quiere terminar mañana, perfect. If you want to finish everything in this week, perfect. Okay? The platform is not tight for the classes, right? You can advance you can advance as much as you want on the platform. Ask for help. And we are going to be more than glad to assist you. Any question about this one? No, is it okay? Do you think that we can work on that? No question. Uh, teacher, I have a question. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to, to show you my name is Raul de Jesus Benitez and I, I am new here and I I have uh, uh, some question and I want to know if you if you can to share uh, this information on the group. Yes, for uh, sure. Okay, thank you teacher. Yes, I am going to send you all the details. Don't worry. I am going to send you this picture and some other information that I am going to share in a moment, I am going to send everything on the WhatsApp group, okay? Don't worry, don't worry, because those things are very important, okay? Don't worry about that. Ahí se van a aburrir de mí en el grupo de WhatsApp, van a decir, ay, no la teacher otra vez. <laughs> but it's going to be good and beneficial, don't worry. Let's get to know the platform, yes? I have a question. Um, yep. ayer... Okay, maybe because, no, maybe because the access were not uh, updated. Right now, I think you can do it. All of you have access to it. Creo que ahorita sí, ya todos tienen acceso a la plataforma. So try to do it. Try to do it today, and you will see that it is going to be done. Okay. Yo creo que ya ahorita sí ya pueden entrar y la pueden revisar. Okay, so 
we're going to know the platform a little bit right now, but let me stop this, okay? And I am going to go and share the platform with everybody. Let me open the platform here. For the ones that it is your first time here, this is the platform, right? This is the one that we are going to be working on. As you can see here, the platform has five different sections and each section has different exercises. Let me show it to you, okay? As you can see, each of the sections has different exercises to cover. And here you have the presentation of the, the topic. It always has a video, right? We are going to start with our friend, the past tense. And it has some exercises that you need to work on. Okay, all the ones that have a little pencil right here are the ones that are going to be uh, evaluated, right? All this should be evaluated, okay? Todos los que tienen marcado un lapicito son los ejercicios evaluados. Así que traten de no dejar ninguno a medias, okay? So let's work on each of them. And it is important that you check the video for the information and then you complete the exercise. If you have any question about this, then for sure you can ask. Here on the top, right, en la parte de arriba de su plataforma, se pueden dar cuenta que hay una sección que se llama a Student's Manual, okay? This is the little book that you are going to be using, okay? You have to click here. Tienen que darle click ahí donde dice Manual del Estudiante. And you are going to get the book, okay? You are going to get the book that you are going to be using. I think this one, it's not loading. I don't know why, but this should give you the book. Okay, aquí le va a aparecer el libro. No sé, ahorita no me lo está cargando. There you go. And you can download it on your computer and you can work on it uh, on the computer. Okay, so here are the different units that you are going to be covering. And you can actually study the different units, the grammar, and the different parts that we are going to be studying during these 16 days, okay? So this is the manual that you are going to be using. And for sure, in the course, you have the different sections that we are going to be covering, okay? So this is the platform, okay? Yo creo que ahorita todos tienen acceso, así que eh, creo que ya pueden entrar a trabajar en ella. La sección número tres, Tiene sus ejercicios y el midterm exams. En la sección 3 van a encontrar los ejercicios de la mitad de curso. Y en la sección 5, la sección a trabajar y los exámenes finales. Okay. So this is the platform that we are going to be using. If you have any question with the platform, let me know. Okay. And besides this, I am going to be uh, sending you some material. I am going to be sending you some exercises on the chat. Okay, aparte de la plataforma, les voy a enviar otros ejercicios, material que puedan ocupar para seguir estudiando. Okay, so this is the platform that we are going to be using. And I am going to call the attendance right now. Le voy a pasar lista en este momento. So we can make sure that all of us are here and we can start working on the different things that we need to do, okay? So when you listen to your name, remember to say here or present, okay? And let's start. I am going to do this every single day in the middle of the class, okay? So by this moment, you are going to be connected already and there's not going to be problem with the attendance, okay? Alejandra Beatriz. Your teacher. Thank you very much. And let's continue here. Okay, Alejandra. Yes. Angelica Yamilet. Cecilia de Los Angeles. Cesar Guadalupe. Here, teacher. Thank you. Here, teacher, here. Thank you very much. Edgar, Edgar Abel. Here, teacher. Thank you. Edson Stanley. 
Eduardo José. Present teacher. Elvia Lorenzana. Elvira, sorry, Elvira. Ok, Ever Ernesto. Present teacher. Thank you very much. Isabo Elizabeth. Present teacher. Is it correct? ¿Te dije el nombre correcto? Yes. Isabo. That's, that's my, yes. first, my first student with that name. En mis 19 años, soy mi primer estudiante con ese nombre. That's so nice. Ok, eh, no sé si me escuchó, teacher, pero present. <laughs> ok, let's see. Ok, ok. Solo me ponen el, el... Ok, let's see. Good, let's continue. Jenny Elizabeth. Good, teacher. Thank you very much. Jeremia Ezequiel. Present teacher. Joana Yesenia. Present teacher. Jose Daniel. Jose Fernando. Present teacher. Karen Stephanie. Present teacher. Catherine Alejandra. Present teacher. Miguel Ángel Domínguez. Present teacher. Thank you. Eh, Nidia Esmeralda. Present teacher. Raúl de Jesús. Present teacher. Raúl Reina, de Jesús. Thank you. Eh, Reina Elizabeth. Present teacher. Samuel Isaac. Present teacher. Sandra Leticia. Present teacher. Thank you very much. Eh, Jancy Estrid. Here, teacher. Thank you. And Jancy Astrid. Jancy Astrid. It's not Astrid, yes. right? Ast Astrid. <laughs> okay, good, good, good. And let's see, Angelica Yamilet. Nope. Edson Stanley. Yes, right. Mr. Edson. And let's see, Elvira. No, right. So the rest is here. Good. After all these general things that I needed to do. Okay. Es, el primer día es un día lleno de generalidades y cosas que hacer. But it is always necessary to keep it track. What are some of the agreements that we are going to be working in class? The first one, to practice your English as much as possible. Okay. I need you to do your best to practice every day. The best thing that you can do is to try to force yourself to speak in English, right? That is the best part. Try to think in English. Try to participate. Try to speak. The problem is that you say like, I know, I better say this in Spanish. Okay, no, mejor me paso español, es más fácil. No, but because you are not helping yourself. Try to do it in English. Try to speak in English. Try to say it in English, okay? Even when it is difficult, even when you cannot do it perfect, try to do it, okay? No digan no puedo. That is not an option, right? It is not an option to say that you cannot do the things. Ask for help whenever you need. If you don't know, teacher, how do you say it? Teacher, what is the meaning? Teacher, can you help me? Teacher, I don't understand. Teacher, repeat, and I am going to do it. Keep your cameras on all the time for you to be present in class. Keep the microphones off if we are not using it. Attend all your sessions on time, right? I need you to be here, I need you to be on time, and I need you to be present in class. Participate as much as possible, right? Participate as much as possible because it is going to help you to uh, to give better results, participate. Keep a cooperative attitude during class. That is going to help you learn more, right? Collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. It's going to help you and it's going to help the group. If you have the answer, if you know the answer, use it, 
¿ok? Si alguien pone, por ejemplo, miren, necesito ayuda con el ejercicio 1 de la sección 1, y usted ya lo hizo, you can help. ¿Ok? It's not like, ay, pobrecito, está trabado. No, help your friends, ¿ok? Help your friends on the group. It's not like, ay, cosita, sorry. <laughs> no, help your friends. If you say like, hey, I did it, I finished. I have the answer, I can help you. So, use it. Go ahead. Eh, practice speaking with the audios every day. And you are going to say, what is that? I haven't done this in my levels. This is something different. This is something that I do. This is my personal practice. Every day in the morning, I am going to send you a question in the WhatsApp group. And you have to send me an answer in an audio for one minute, okay? And you're going to say, El, ¿qué? one minute of audio, oh my God. Yes, the first days are going to be terrible. And I am sure about it. Teacher, lo he grabado nueve veces. Teacher, lo he grabado diez veces. No me sale, me cuesta. The first days. Then the next days is going to be like, ah, good, the question. Ta, 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 ta. More than one minute. You will see. How does it work? I am going to send you the question. For example, tell me about your last Christmas. And you're going to say, well, teacher, last Christmas was very fantastic. I did this and this and this. I ate this and that and da, 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 da. You have to tell me information about the question for one minute in an audio, in a voice note. Okay? Se ponen ahí en WhatsApp, pum, grabar audio. You send the audio and that's it. All your friends can listen and all your friends can actually learn from you. It is not going to be perfect. Maybe the first days. Yeah, but with the time, it's going to help you improve your fluency and your speaking. What do you think about this activity? ¿Qué piensan acerca de esta actividad? ¿Le gusta, no le gusta? ¿La hacemos, no la hacemos? Uh -huh. Sounds great. It sounds great? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I like it's, that. It's Everybody. okay, is it? Okay, every day we are going to practice. We're going to practice every single day, a lot of speaking. And you will see the difference. Allá en el día 16 me van a decir la diferencia. And you will say, teacher, I have improved. My speaking is different. My fluency is different. I have more vocabulary. I investigated. I did this and that. For some questions, I am going to ask you to investigate a little bit. You can go and read, okay? No está eh, algo como... No les puedo decir, no, no se puede hacer. Si ustedes quieren ir a investigar acerca de algún tema, you can do it. For example, you can say, tell me the best or the funniest story about your family. And you can investigate online, right? Historia graciosa de familia. And then you can get ideas of vocabulary. And then you can say, ah, I can share this and this with the teacher. And then you can build up your answers. Okay, investigate, read. And that's perfect. The only thing that I am going to ask you is to be original, right? You don't have to be like, like little robots, right? Teacher, today I am going to tell you about my last birthday. My last birthday was good. No, right? Try to be fluent. Try to be fluent. Try to be original on your answers. If you want to write the answer first, that's good. But the idea is that you create your audio as fluent as possible. Okay, so that is going to happen every single day. Mañana en la mañana, de repente, van a ver ahí un buenos días de su teacher, and then the question. And then you have all the day for you to answer. Tienen todo el día, hasta antes de las ocho, para enviar su audio. Okay? So that is going to be the practice, the extra practice that we are going to have. Take the best out of your virtual class. I really need you to... Um, Take advantage of this moment that we are together. Participate as much as you can because this is your learning moment of the day. This is the moment for yourself, right? Set your space. Set your space. What do I mean for this? Get a specific space to receive the class. 
the best place is if you have a wall behind and you don't have people passing behind yourself, okay? Lo mejor sería que estuvieran con una pared de fondo. ¿Para qué? Para que nadie pueda pasar atrás de, de, de cámara o algo y que usted se siente interrumpido, okay? Utilicen el mismo espacio, lejos del ruido, lejos de las interrupciones, okay? Y con su mejor conexión, vea. But set your space. Que tengan su mesa, que todo esté limpio, que tengan su cuaderno y todo listo para aprender. Take notes. Ask questions at the moment of the class. If I am busy, if I am busy, send the question on the chat or send the question on WhatsApp. And I am going to be more than glad to attend your questions. Stay away from pets and family that might distract you or interrupt you. In some cases, we love to be with Kaiser there, right? Es que el chuchito se viene aquí a jugar conmigo. In the moment of the class, keep it far from you because it can interrupt you, right? I know accidents can happen, right? We can see the cat passing in front of the camera. We can see the dog there, the dog barking, but that's normal. But in some cases, the students are playing with the dog in the class and that is not the idea, okay? And the family members, for example, tell your family, tell your family. Chicos, chicas, a todos los de su casa, estoy en clase. Okay, así que porfa, eh, respetemos este momento que tengo para mí. Yo sé que cuesta mucho a veces que toda la familia pues, sí, que la, que la, que la. Next to you, find a space far from the noise. That is, that is going to help you a lot in your learning process, okay? Find a space that it's for you. And keep away any device or television that might distract you. Si de repente usted tiene la tele cerca, off, okay? Ay, voy a poner el radio para la clase. No, right? <laughs> it is not necessary. Stay away from all the different distractions. And you can, if you have your phone next to you, right? If it is really necessary, check it, right? But don't, don't check on TikTok or Facebook or whatever during the class because, I mean, it is a moment for you to uh, learn and for you to practice, okay? Those are the things that I have to focus on, okay? So take the best advantage of your virtual class. Remember, dress comfortable for the class, use comfortable clothes, but for sure you are not going to be there in, in centro, <laughs> in the class. Ay, teacher, es que qué calor. No, right? <laughs> Respect the class, right? Respect your friends. And remember that we are on camera and we are recording the class. So uh, dress nicely. It's not that you are going to be con saco y corbata, but normal, that, right? Be comfortable to be in class. And let's see, Elvira, thank you very much for being here. I am going to mark you on the attendance. Here it is, okay? So that is the best out of the virtual class. But now a lot of speaking for teacher Nati, that's enough. And I need to meet the team because you are my team right now, right? I am helping you grow and I want to meet my team. How am I going to meet my team? You are going to tell me your student profile. You are going to tell me the things that you love to do, the things that you need to improve, who you are, what you need to learn. Right, and I have a couple of questions for all of you. The first one, you have to tell me a little bit about you and what you do, okay? You have to tell me a little bit about your English journey. How has been the process of learning? How did you learn English before? What do you enjoy the most in your life and in the classes? What is something that you cannot stand in your life and in the classes. What do you do to practice your English? And what do you need to improve about English? I need you to write the answers for those sentences in your notebook because you are going to use them later to share them with your friends. Me and what I do, okay? You are going to say, well, hello everybody. My name is, uh, what? Edgar Abel, I am 20 years old, I am from El Salvador, I am an engineer, I don't know, right? You have to explain what you do. My English journey, in my case, for example, 
I learned, I started learning English when I was nine years old. And then I have been learning during my whole life. I have studied in different places. Where did you study before? Did you go to any academy? Did you learn by yourself? How did you learn English? What is something that you cannot stand? It's like, ah, I don't like, uh, for example, to wait for people. That's in my personal life. I don't like to wait for people. And what is something that I cannot stand about English? Uh, not having the time to read. That is something that I hate, right? What do I do to practice? I read, I watch videos, I uh, listen to music in English. And what do I need to improve? I need to improve my listening teacher. I have a lot of problems. I need to improve my speaking. I have a lot of difficulties. I need those answers from you so I can see what type of students I have and what can I do to help you. So without further ado, I am going to give you some time for you to write down your answers, okay? Respondamos a todas estas, eh, a todos estos puntos que tenemos aquí. Le voy a dar alrededor de cinco minutos para que ustedes puedan poner sus respuestas. Okay? Go ahead. If you have any question, go ahead. Tell me. Write your answers on your notebook. If you don't have a notebook, this is the moment for you to go and run and get one. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm using the pencil. Okay. <laughs> You're missing the pencil. It's the most I important got, thing. I got it already. <laughs> okay. If not, go and get one from your kid. Like, hijo, dame ese cuaderno. Y este lapicero. <laughs> It is always necessary to have it there. There you go. Write your answers. Whenever you have your answers ready, tell me, okay? Uh, there are many, many cameras that I cannot see. Hay muchos de ustedes que no tienen la cámara encendida, no los puedo ver. Elvira, eh, Karen, Alejandra, Reinita, Ever, Katherine, Samuel. Okay, remember it is important to keep it on during the whole class. Okay, write down your answers. If you need help, let me know. I am going to send you the image as well. Let me know when you finish. Try to give complete answers to each of the items. And in the last one, what do I need to improve? Be honest, okay? It's not like nothing, teacher. I have the perfect English, right? Be honest. It's like, teacher, I need help with listening. 
with speaking, with writing, with listening, with conversations. We are going to do many conversations here in the module, don't worry. Okay, when you finish, you can tell me. Ready, teacher, I finish. Teacher, I'm sorry. Um, no entendí qué es lo que vamos a hacer. Okay, <laughs> don't, don't worry, that's okay, that's okay. Here you have a couple of sentences, right? This is going to help me to know you as a student. Esto me va a servir a mí para conocer su perfil de estudiante. The first one says, me and what I do. ¿Quién eres tú y qué es lo que haces en tu vida? Okay? Todas tus cosas generales que quieras compartir con nosotros. Vea. Me, my name is Nidia. I am 38 years old. I live in San Salvador, in Ilopango, wherever you live. And what do you do? I am a teacher, I am an engineer, I am a doctor, I am a nurse, everything, right? ¿Quién eres y qué es lo que haces? My English journey, en este vas a hablar acerca de tu trayectoria en el idioma. ¿Cuándo empezaste a aprender? ¿Dónde has aprendido? ¿Si has ido a algún lugar a aprender? So, tell us a little bit about your experience with the language. What I enjoy the most in your life, for example, you can say, I enjoy traveling, I enjoy visiting the beach, I enjoy going to the mountains, I enjoy speaking English, I enjoy listening to music, right? What do you like to do in your life? What I cannot stand. Que es algo que no puedes soportar, que no te gusta. Okay? You say like, I really hate uh, reading in some cases. People hate to read. I really hate listening to, uh, I don't know, reggaeton music because it's nonsense. You can say or I cannot stand a, a grammar. There are many people who hate grammar, right? What do I do to practice? ¿Qué haces para practicar el idioma? Right? I watch videos, I practice in the apps, I watch TV, I watch Netflix, I don't know, in English. And what do I need to improve? ¿Qué es lo que necesitas mejorar tú como estudiante? Right? All these answers are personal. Todas esas preguntas, todas esas oraciones, las vamos a contestar de manera personal. Okay? Es que mi hermano no habla, teacher. No, it's your thing. It's your answer. So, I, I think that I could give you a little bit of light on these answers. Okay, Nidia? it's a good explanation. <laughs> yes, yes, okay. Uh, now, you, you got it. Good. Thank you very much. That's, that's the best thing, you see? If you don't know, tell me. Teacher, I need help. Teacher, how do you do it? Teacher, I don't understand. And I will be more than glad to clarify. Did anyone finish already? Finished, teacher. Sure. Okay, finish. thank you. Finish, finish. Finish. Okay. I will I, I'm done. Okay, you are done. Very good. I'm going to give one more minute to all the rest to finish. Because right now I am going to send you to work together, okay? En lo que terminan sus compañeros, voy a armar los grupos de trabajo. And I am going to have you working in little groups. In the groups, you are going to give your answers to your friends, right? You are going to read your answers for your friends. And so you are going to get to know each other a little bit more, okay? You are going to receive a little invitation on your phone or on the computer. And I need you to click on accept, okay? And you are going to be sent to the work uh, rooms, okay? I have groups of four students, groups of four. So please, I need you to accept my invitation to go to the different groups right now. I am going to send it and I need you to share your answers. Share your answers with the group, okay? So you can get to know each other and you are going to see when I 
bring you back what we are going to do with this. Accept the invitation to go to the groups and share your answers. Van a compartir sus respuestas con sus compañeros del grupo. Son cuatro o cinco miembros por grupo. Go ahead. Accept your invitation and let's go to the groups right now. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for accepting the invitation. And Karen, did you receive the invitation to go to the groups? Karen Sita. Hello. Okay. I will check on the groups to see how they are doing. Enjoy to listen. Uh, um, I Mm. What I can stand, dijo la maestra, ¿qué significaba? Que no soporto. Ok. Uh, I can stand the, the lie. The lie, ok. <laughs> yeah. When people lie to you. Yeah, I hate <laughs> that too as well. I don't like <laughs> it. I... Mm, I uh, the practice in English. Uh -huh. Okay. I do to pra I do to practice uh, watch the video uh -huh. uh, listen audio. Okay. Uh, okay. I need to improve the speak okay you need, to, you need to improve, you need to improve your I, speaking i i i afraid okay yeah. you don't have to be afraid that is the first the first thing that you have to keep in mind don't be afraid to fail okay because okay. here we are to learn and you are going to speak a lot here don't worry okay continue working i'm going to check on the next group continue okay I love is to go out with my family and what I can't I can't stand uh, uh, I I can stand uh, my uh, uh, when I hear uh, the pet the dog uh, when they are barking that's uh, I can uh, I can stand and what do I do to practice uh, well, I uh, well I, I watch videos in YouTube um, and read uh, some books. And what do I need to improve? Um, I uh, I think that I have to practice and practice and practice. Okay, very good. Okay. <laughs> when when you listen to dogs barking, <laughs> come on. <laughs> That's hard. Go ahead, Edgar. Okay, I'm going to tell about myself. Uh, my name is Edgar Abel Tejada Benitez. And what do I do? I 
I, I like to practice like baseball or soccer. I like to practice sport. Uh, I am married already. Uh, I like to visit my family. The next one is uh, my English journal. I can say that more than 80% I've been learning for myself. Uh, just when I took like classes from the uh, middle school and high school, just, to, just I took the, a couple of hours of English. Why, what can, in, what I enjoy the most? Uh, that is like my, I like to go to the mall, uh, go to the beach, and, and pra practice sport. What, 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 what I can stand. Mm. What a little, what that do, please. Something that you can, cannot stand. For example, if you don't like homework, you say, I know homework. I cannot stand homework. I hate it. Something okay. that I can't no. stand, it's like, I hate. For example, mm -hmm. Jesus uh, was mentioning about the barking of the dogs. Okay. Like, Whoa. okay. The only thing that I dislike is that it's a kind of music like. Mm, the reggaeton or, or perreo, I, I, I hate that music. <laughs> so that's something that you can't stand, so you see? Yeah, yeah. That's good. What do I do for practice? I used to listen music on you on YouTube, uh, like videos and and watch TV in English. Very what, good. What titles. What do I need to improve? I, I need to read and like listen to music and write as well. Okay, very good job. Continue, continue group. I am going to check on the next one. Continue working. Un poquito a poco, ¿no? El asunto es eh, practicar un poquito. In English. Porque si no se olvide. Sí. In English. Okay. <laughs> you know, I was like, nothing. <laughs> You it's know, teacher. sorry, no, no. teacher. Sorry, no, it's, it's okay. But the idea is like you say, like, I see, sí, es que el inglés como cuesta, ¿verdad? but we need to practice. The only way to do it is through practice, right? Okay. If you consider yeah. that it's difficult, try it, try to do it in English. And and maybe you sometimes think it's like, I know, es que la llena no me va a entender en español, se lo voy a decir. No la estamos ayudando, ni nos estamos ayudando. So try to yeah. do it in English. And Jenny. The difficult is, uh -huh. the difficult is, to, is, to, is to sing in, in English. But if you don't force, if you don't force your brain to practice, it is going to be like that, translating all the time. Su cerebro va a decir, no, este ya va a hablar en español, ni me esfuerzo. No, you have to force yourself to do it. <laughs> it is difficult, it is complicated, but it's not impossible. You have to do it. Yeah, you yeah. have to practice. You have to practice your English. Okay, I am going to take you back to the main room because I need to give an announcement. Let's go. Welcome back. Uh-huh. How was the experience after vacation speaking in English? It was like ta 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 ta. -ta. <laughs> okay, this is the moment when you think it's like I need to practice more. <laughs> okay, welcome back to all of you. It is important, I was mentioning to one group, it is important to practice your English even when you consider that it's impossible. If when you want to jump to Spanish, do it in English. When you want to say like, en español se lo puede decir, no, do it in English because you are not helping each other if you switch to Spanish. For tomorrow, I need you to build up your presentation in a very good way, okay? 
your presentation, the one that you were going to do today, I need you to sharp it a little bit more, okay? So tomorrow you can introduce yourself and say, hello class, my name is Natalie, I am 38 years old, I am an English teacher. Well, I learned English when I was nine years old and I really enjoy it. Something that I love to do is to go to the beach, blah, 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 blah. I need you to create your presentation using all your answers. Usando todas esas respuestas de, las, de los items que les di, creen su presentación, okay? But clean and nice and fluent, right? Try to do it for tomorrow. Try to practice, right? Try to practice and try to have it ready because you are going to use it, okay? Today you had the chance to practice a little bit and you did it. But tomorrow I am going to get random students. Durante esos días de la semana voy a agarrar así random students. Unos cuatro mañana, unos cuatro el jueves, el, unos cuatro viernes, cuatro el lunes para presentarse, okay? And it has to be fluent and nice. Nothing like, eh, my name is eh, Nati and eh, no, you have to practice to make it as natural as possible. Okay, that will be the first challenge of the class. And tomorrow you are going to receive your audio in the morning for you to answer during the day. Tienen todo el día para mandar el audio. Así no es que se los mando a las ocho y a las ocho y dos, tres, ya tiene que estar. No. Practice your answer. Practice your uh, the speaking, what you are going to say before, but that is going to be for tomorrow. Well, my dear students, it has been such a great pleasure to be with you today, to meet you and to be here to help you. Okay, I am going to see you tomorrow. Get ready for tomorrow's class and Thank prepare, you much. Yeah. prepare your presentation. Have a very good night. Rest a lot. And I'm going to see you, you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. Nice to meet you, everyone. Good night, everyone. Have a good night. Thank you. Nice, Thank you. nice good night. to meet you. Bye-bye. Okay, good care. Good night, everybody.